Hidden amongst the sprawling concrete jungle that is surface paradise, a quaint little reminder of a bygone era. I don't know of anything around at the moment similar to this in surface paradise. With its old weatherboard facade and corrugated iron roof, this 1950s beach shack has stood the test of time. One of the last post-war cottages left standing in the suburb. It's been held uh, in the family for 41 years, so uh, this is the first time offered. The three-bedroom, two-bathroom cottage, a little rough around the edges, but it still pulled a crowd. Where do we go? Starting bid, ladies and gentlemen, you call it wherever you're comfortable. Bidding was fast. Hit 750 bid in, but a bid 750 and it's good real estate. Competition fierce before the hammer fell. It is going, going, done and sold. Congratulations to you. Sold for $870,000 to new owners Lee and Julia. We saw the originality of it and uh, the location and that was very appealing. The beach down the road, yeah, so just 30 second walk to the beach. It's great for lifestyle. When it comes to keeping up with the Joneses, the new owners have plenty of levels to build. But there won't be any new high rise here. This property will stay as it has for the past 41 years, a family home. Well, maybe just a little bigger. Chris on it, that's first, but yeah, Try no. and make it larger, yeah. <laughs> so we can fit everything in. Water it to make it larger. Tyson Cottrell, Nine News.